Hello, in this video we're going to look at finding the firm's minimum efficient scale. The minimum efficient scale is the quantity of output where average cost is smallest. We'll start with the firm's total cost equation, C equals 50 plus Q plus 0.5 Q squared. So to find the efficient scale, step one is to get average cost. Average cost is total cost divided by the quantity of output. So we're going to divide the C equation completely through by Q, so 50 divided by Q. Q divided by Q gives us 1, and 0.5Q squared divided by Q leaves us with 0.5Q. Once we have average cost, we want to find where it is minimized. So to do that, we will take the derivative of average cost with respect to output and set that derivative result equal to 0. So the derivative of 50 divided by Q, using the quotient rule, gives us minus 50 divided by Q squared. The derivative of 1 is 0, and the derivative of 0.5Q is just 0.5. So we set that derivative equal to 0 and solve for Q. So moving some things around, we get this result. I'm going to multiply everything through by Q squared. And then we're going to divide everything through by 0.5. So 50 divided by 0.5 is 100. So we have Q squared equals 100. Raising both sides to the 1 half power, or taking the square root of both sides, Q equals 10. So at 10 units of output, average cost is minimized or at its smallest value. Let's do one more example. Example 2. The firm's total cost is given by the following equation. Average cost is total cost divided by Q. That leaves us with this result. Taking the derivative of average cost with respect to quantity and setting that derivative equal to 0. The derivative of 25 is 0. The derivative of minus 10Q is minus 10. And the derivative of Q squared is 2Q. So we'll get 2q equals 10, and q equals 5 will be our efficient scale. Okay, I hope you found this video helpful.